Artificial intelligence is, of course, has a huge impact on music today. Hello, my name is Örjan Sandred. I'm a composer and I'm a professor of music composition at the Dusseltel Faculty of Music at the University of Manitoba. I've been into music my whole life. I got very fascinated by the fact when I was very young that you can actually write music on paper and then understand what the sound is, so to speak. The power of music is definitely the expression of music. The, the fascinating thing is that you can code into sounds a lot of emotions. There is, seems to be emotions in music that people, in a big group of people, people can agree on, on how they feel about music. Music is closely related to society and where we are in history. It's always been like that. The, the most important music of any time has been communicating with, with its environment. And now I think the thing that's happening right now is AI. And there is no way AI cannot have an impact on music. The goal with that in my own work has been to create this machine as a partner um, to, to communicate with ideas, throw ideas towards and see, get them back and see if they're good or bad. And in that way, it's, it's a fantastic tool for me to understand um, how my music is built. If you bring artificial intelligence to the constant situation and bring it together with humans, then you, you have a dialogue between the musician as a performer and the machine as a quasi-performer. Uh, and by interacting, you can reach new type of expressions. So the role of artificial intelligence in music is not to replace uh, performers. Music is about, is, is about being inspired, it's about wanting to express something. And a machine, today at least, cannot be inspired in that way. I do not see it as a threat. And always with music, it's not a question of evolving into something better, but something that reflects where are we today? What are we today? You know, what, what, what type of music uh, could exist today? And what does it mean?